Welcome back to System Shock. In order to launch the groves, we need to fix a problem in maintenance. So let's do that, starting with alpha maintenance. Let's turn the power up. There's another one. Let's turn this to max power. Okay. If you're on max power, then you have to hold down left click to charge it up. I think on the other powers, though, it just shoots. Let's double check that. Medium power. Yeah. Yeah, there's no charge up. If you click or hold it down, it just shoots right away. Let me go top up my energy. All right. There's at least one more. Oh no, at least two more. One shot to take him out. That is, this thing is so good. And it feels so nice to use. This looks important. Interface demodulator. Hey, we found like a working interface demodulator somewhere. This is probably what we need it for. We're probably going to find one that's broken. And we need to replace it. These all look fine. I assume they'd be red if they weren't. seem fine. Absolute maze. I know there's a relay analyzer that requires a code, so we're also on the lookout for some sort of a code. Assault rifle. And oh, it's a large magnesium tip box. 48 rounds. Nice. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm missing something. Because that's the entire area, and it appears to be perfectly fine. Then again, maybe not every maintenance area 
has an issue. Do I have a passcode that I can put into the relay analyzer? I didn't think I did, but maybe I do. Oh, I think the relay number that we need to put in the relay analyzer is actually mentioned in the repair diagnostics message that we got itself. It says malfunction in subsystem relay 428. That's got to be it. Yeah. Replace broken interface demodulator. Okay. I mean, that was kind of obvious. I was already looking for broken interface demodulators. And I didn't find it, but maybe you have to do that for it to even appear? If, like, is there only one that's broken? If there's only one, then three of these maintenance areas, because it looks like there's four of them. There's Delta, Gamma, Alpha, Beta. Only one of them would actually have any problems, so maybe there just wasn't a problem here. Got all the interfaces on me and got rid of a bunch of my weapons so I can actually fit them. Uh, went back and looked in alpha maintenance and didn't actually see any modulators that were broken still, so maybe there just isn't any up there. Let's check out beta maintenance. Level security is 47%. I love the way the like cooling cells on the side of the weapon slowly close as it cools down. It's really cool. Uh, yeah, the reason I'm so excited about the level security. Oh my God, please. The reason I was so excited about the level security is because there's a door here that only opens if level security is below 45%. So I think one more camera and we might be okay. It fires automatically. It doesn't stay charged forever.
poor guy. Okay, so apparently nothing in there as well, which also feels weird. I feel like there should be something in every single one. But let's keep rolling with it. Nothing to be concerned about yet, I suppose. Next one's down here. Gamma. Level security is now 43%. Now we can go in that door. I don't want to go get power. Let's just use this for now. Hold on. We finally found one. Man, look at that chunky thing. The modulator replacement successful. So maybe that was it? Maybe there really was only one thing to fix? I guess I could go back to the error report thing and see if it spits out any more diagnostics. Finish exploring here. Now I know what to look for. These things aren't red, but one of them is black, and this up here says error. Hold on. Just peeking my nose up there. Oh, I saw another Easter egg. Oh, I'm out of power now. That's fine. I don't need to get the Easter egg. It says diagnosis not available, so I don't think there's anything more to fix. Okay, now we should be able to go into the maintenance office now that security is low enough. Manually locked. Biometric retinal scanner. Retinal check failed. So I need someone else's eyes? I think that's inside the door. Right. Well, I don't know when I'm going to get someone else's eyes, but... Not now. I feel like I should still explore the last maintenance area. Just because who knows what's in there. Probably nothing to fix, but maybe something else. Delta maintenance.
Are those gonna shock me? Oh, yep. Projectiles. So there's a, another way to get a railgun. It's more than one. Did something just start shooting behind me. Almost everywhere. Got a little bit more down this hallway. And that's it. Alright, the master control switch in Diego's office should now finally work. Yes. Genesee now enabled for all groves. Oh my god. Yeah, I was thinking things might change. Surely we would anger Shodan at some point and they try to stop us. If, if I have to release my infected children to stop you, I so be it. Okay, I think the only one I need to release is Beta Grove. Which is why Shodan is angry now that I'm heading over to beta. That sounds fucking horrible. Uh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What do I have? Sounds biological, so let's go with something that does fire damage. Try that again. I didn't realize there were so many of them. Scanner gun? How much is that worth? 15 scrap. Not bad. We go. Bye bye. Grove jettisoned. I want to watch it go. Beta Grove already jettisoned. OK, 
Okay, so that means the biological contamination is gone. And now we should be able to use the elevator that was in Diego's office to go up to the next floor. I think ultimately we're trying to go to the bridge to gain control. Explosives. All right, let's go gather it up. Got the plastic explosives. This elevator should work now. Engineering. Yes. I also ditched my mag pulse rifle because I think I have enough uh, things that have good armor penetration, and I just need to save inventory space. Oh god. We good? That only took out 2% of the level security. Damn. swap these because the scorpion is kind of my mainstay uh, thing for armored opponents and then the assault rifles what I'm using for fleshy opponents oh three heals nice Cardinal points of the level. Okay. Northeast, southwest. That's new. God, what is that thing? It looks so cool. I don't know if I should be using something good for fleshy opponents or armored opponents. It's got fleshy and armored bits. Maybe armored? It's mostly armored, I think. Mutated cyborg. It's not very specific. Gamma quadrant. Ooh. 
This place goes up a lot. Beta Quadrant seems to be open. Alpha's open. Delta's open. Ah, oh, right, that's where we came from. Then maybe let's continue to explore Delta Quadrant before we head to the others. Each one probably has its own antenna. Oh boy! Um, I don't have any of the heavy weapons on me. I do have this. Yeah, got it. Ammunition? Here oh, it's floating. Large box of Teflon rounds. Sweet. I still have the isolinear chipset, but Diego's minions are almost on me. All right, Diego. You want the chip? You want it? Come and get it! You backstabbing, bootleg veteran! I think the isolinear chip is what I need to defeat Showdown from the bridge, if I remember right from a message that I read a while ago. Uh, okay, what's this upgrade for? It's for the Scorpion. Increases magazine capacity to 50 rounds. Oh, hell yeah. That wasn't too bad. Didn't even hit him with the EMP. That's the biological systems monitor, which I already have. There's so many different pathways to go. That's where I come in.
Is this the robot I shot at the end of the hallway? Yeah, it is. Mother's will be done. Sockets and bones stand no chance. Antenna. Engineering computer cyberspace lock. Oh my god, I already have a stack of ten of these. Okay, let's not bother picking that up. Secrets? Come on. Oh, Jesus. Let him go. Fuck me. Oh, fuck me. I killed something. I think I I think I killed them both. Oh wow. I think I'm okay. Holy crap, that thing was scary. I think I'd rather brave the dark than this. No, I don't need another one of those. Cyborg Warrior. Uh, where did we even come from? Was it here? Yeah. Oh yeah, 50 Teflon rounds. That just looks really cool. I feel like I should be able to use that.
Ooh, a teleporter. No idea where that's going to terminate. Experimental teleport. Hmm. I mean, the last one was experimental, too. They're all experimental, so... Why not? Oh, this is not marked. Teleporter. Oh, Jesus. Well, that's a fun surprise. Anyone else? Were they just waiting for me? Oh yeah, logic probe. Instant puzzle solver. Haven't had one of those in a long time. Armory. Oh, that doesn't work, does it? Dang it. Well, that looks like a door. It's even marked as a door on the map. Can't use it though. out of Teflon coated rounds. How effective are normal rounds? Armor penetration 25%. That's that's kind of unusably bad. I don't think I can use that. But yeah, shotgun normal rounds are 50% armor penetration. That's not bad. The ion pulse rifle is fantastic. All right, the incendiary rounds for the assault rifle are not bad. Yeah, hey, hold on. How many penetrator rounds do I have for the assault rifle? Enough for a full magazine. So, yeah, let's do the scorpion for fleshy things now and the assault rifle for armored things. I have a... Oh! Jesus! Fuck me! One shot! Wow! And the EMP disables their shield. Oh, that was amazing! Wow! 40 Teflon coated rounds on them, too. That was effective beyond my wildest dreams.
Oh, we're back to the central, like, ring. Yeah, what did I... How did I... Oh, I got over there from teleporting, right. Okay. Uh, let's continue to explore Alpha Quadrant, I guess. Now that I'm here now. that computer cyberspace lock to actually get to the antenna. Since there's two of them, let's go with grenades. bodies at this point. Mm, okay, how many Teflon coated rounds do we have? Because I'm out of... Yeah, full. Full magazine. I'm out of the um, penetrator rounds for the assault rifle, so... This is back to being for meaty things, and this is for armored things. Wait, I've just gone in a circle. Oh my god, this map is so confusing. I know I haven't been up here. I think. Have I? No, no I haven't. Oh! Progress. Oh, this is that central room again, but I'm up on a floor that maybe you can't get to normally.
this one is just completely broken. Let's try beta. I guess. Oh no, that's just a shortcut to get to beta, I guess. Like that didn't really accomplish anything special. Because I've already been here. Just opened Gamma from the core. Because why not? What did that just do? Oh, it toggles these on and off? Yeah, it looks like you can only have one open at a time. Hmm. I hear an explosive. Where the hell is it? These all seem to head to ladders. Ooh. Standard station restoration procedures online. Awesome, I can reconstruct there. Oh, there's a cargo lift. We can heal. This is great. So bin down there, and then it loops around to there. Let's try this one. Requires less than 18% level security. I mean, it's just going to lead to an area I've already been to. Less than 18 level security. Just misspelled that, but whatever. Cool, let it cool, let it cool. Come on again. Med back up there was a bait. I could go back and refill my power, or I could just use this.
Is this antenna actually free to access without doing the cyberspace lock? Let's go there in a second. Ooh, CPU nodes. Thirty three per cent. It's so going to go down again. 17%. Boop. Sixteen per cent. Fifteen per cent. on the map it shows like an item here is there a level above me oh i think there might be i think there's maybe an item like right up right up there how would you get there though God, they had their head blown apart going into cyberspace here. Jesus. Oh, hey. Standard issue security measure, engineering, keycard. We can't override Shota and everything we try fails. She's using the CPU nodes to scramble things. Now, if we can take down the CPUs on levels one through six, digits of the system's authorization code. Then we stand a chance, but how can we even do that if we can't even defend ourselves? Wait, how do we get the system authorization code thing from defeating all the CPUs? Like, I think I've defeated all the CPUs, but did they have a... <gasps> Wait a minute. They have had a thing, haven't they? There's always been this, like, weird monitor by all the CPU nodes. And I never realized it was, like, part of a password. Uh, but I think each level has had, like, maybe a single digit or something? Oh, shit. Don't tell me I have to go back to all the CPU nodes. If I don't have the authorization code, is this gonna blast my face apart? Okay, screw it. I'm gonna go for it. Alright, I just unlocked all the antennas. No brain explosion. Didn't need to enter the code in there. Not exactly sure what happened to you, my friend, but um, we're fine.
Oh, Christ. Oh. Oh, radiation. Oh, this whole zone. Yeah. Let's not go there yet. Check out Gamma Antenna. Should be fully unlocked now. How many Teflon rounds do I have? Oh, not many. How about armor penetrating rounds? Not many. Okay, so it's down to the shotgun or the ion pulse. Hi. Whew. Not the ideal weapon for that. I think that's the antenna itself. Why is that behind a force field? That's probably where I put the C4. Hacker, stay a while. Oh no, I only have ten seconds. I see. The antenna is still blown up. Well, the Gamma Quadrant antenna is blown up, but I haven't finished exploring Gamma Quadrant itself. around radar unit can penetrate through walls and reveal hidden passageways for a small amount of energy wait sense around is that what i've been using anyway yeah that's the object detection one that i've been using can find hidden pathways 
Does it just mark them on the map like it does for other objects and enemies? I guess probably. What's oh, an elevator? This can go up to security. Will it actually let me? It does. Don't think I want to go there yet, though. this lift up and going. This puzzle is really weird because as far as I can tell, it's literally impossible to solve. So I'm going to come back to this when I have a logic probe and see if that auto solves it and see what the heck it does to solve it. That's really, really weird. Okay, I haven't explored over here yet. Uh, that links around to here. This door was locked. It just has to be open from the other side. Oh, that is definitely going to open, right? Scorpion? Teflon rounds, I think? 39. Yeah, not bad. What about the assault rifle? Not many penetrator rounds. There we go. Okay, so it's just a shortcut to the CPU room. Two 
more railgun projectiles. Oh, I'm definitely going to buy this ammo. that lead to anywhere interesting because we've already been on the other side of that before. Okay, aside from the irradiated zone, it looks like that's it for Gamma Quadrant. Actually, the irradiated zone is in Beta Quadrant, technically. All right, well, I think I'm going to end the episode here, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're going to go find and blow up the Beta Antenna. <laughs>